Hey y'all, welcome back to MK3 Firearms. Today, we're checking out, of course, another high power. That's what we do here. <laughs> you guys are probably used to that by now. Um, as far as uh, high powers go, this one's kind of unique because it has a Crimson Trace laser grip on it. I know you can just add that, that's not custom work, but I don't think we get a lot of these with the laser on it. So, you know, it lines up with the sights about 20 feet out and uh, it's cool. Yeah, you basically have a little button here, a little button there, and as you squeeze with your middle finger, the light goes on. So it's kind of cool. Uh, for sights, we have a Trigicon HD up front. We got the uh, Heine 1911 mil spec ledge in the rear. Of course, we cut the slot so your hammer will fold up nicely right up into the rear. Pretty cool. Uh, the hammer itself, this is one of the cylinder slides. It's not their um, commander hammer. It's their, I can't remember what they call this. Maybe their carry hammer, I believe it is. And of course, we had to reprofile a little bit because we put the beaver tail on this guy. That way it doesn't slam into the beaver tail when it's uh, actually functioning. So I got some space back there. Um, what else? What else? RDIH, uh, slide release lever. Um, yeah. Besides the Cerakote. Oh, ground barrel. 11 degrees into the bushing, of course. And we'll go ahead and show you that trigger job. So, of course, as you guys are probably used to by now, no take up. There's the wall, as you can see. There's your brake. Your reset. Your brake. Reset. Brake. Audible reset. Brake. And once again. And of course, as you take off, there is no take up. It is just straight wall break but yeah pretty cool nice little setup nice little carry setup you know has a beaver tail it's all about function on this guy sights beaver tail trigger job um, crown barrel pretty much everything that connects you to the pistol which you're gonna want for carry even the Christmas race great grips so yeah pretty sweet Garthway trigger oh I didn't mention that yeah that's actually a Garthway trigger and that's what they look like when they're unprofiled so that's just how they kind of come from Garthway and then we reprofile them for some customers who want to do that and others just want to keep it the way it is so it's whatever you like it's your gun guys anyways questions comments concerns leave them and as you know we will answer accordingly until next time guys